Have you guys ever been to VidCon, you know, like the biggest event organization for YouTube creators held every year? Personally, I've never been there uh, yet. And honestly, I'm debating if I <laughs> ever actually wanna go. VidCon, if you guys have not noticed, is kind of turning into a smorgasbord of crazy things happening. We got Logan Paul literally getting tackled by security guards for walking into a horde of his younger fans, which is not exactly the smartest idea. <laughs> not to mention he wasn't actually invited this year, allegedly. We also got YouTubers like Rice Gum as well as FaZe Clan literally getting banned from VidCon for being too popular. But guys, this one takes the cake on everything, okay? Trust me, after you see this, this is gonna make you definitely wish you never went to VidCon. Or at least wish you weren't a security guard working there. Instagram model Christian Burns calls security guards peasants at VidCon. Now, firstly, like, I know VidCon is a place for creators and influencers, but, I mean, come on, like, it's really more directed towards YouTubers, to be specific. So I don't know what this Instagram model is getting on about calling anyone peasants, let alone the security guards. But yeah, guys, let's go ahead and take a look at the video and you guys can judge for yourselves. What is wrong with you people? They're asking you Did he just say, I'm famous and you're not, so you have to listen to me? Well, I think he got cut off at the last part, but I think that's what he was insinuating. <laughs> oh, yep, here it is right here. Dude, I'm famous and you're not, so you listen to, let me guess, me? Okay, listen, Christian Burns. You're a so-called Instagram model. I mean, heck, dude, even if you were like the biggest YouTuber on planet Earth, that does not give you a right to any kind of entitlement to say that you're better than anyone else there. As a human being, we are all equal. And for you to treat the security guards that way, the people that are literally keeping the safety of VidCon, for you to treat them that way to say you're famous, they're not, so they have to listen to you? I know you're an Instagram model. I know you allegedly had, you know, like 27,000 followers. Watch out, guys. But yeah, dude, look, I got like over 50K Instagram followers. I like barely even post on Instagram. And you don't see me, you know, going up to people and like literally telling them that I'm better than you. You have to listen to me. And I definitely would never call anyone a peasant. By the way, 27,000 Instagram followers, my dude. I mean, you famous. You know what? Now I'm actually surprised that these guys don't know who you are. Exactly, it doesn't make you any better. Security guard knows what's up. Okay, so a little bit of backstory as to why Christian Burns is allegedly burning the security guards. There's other footage that I'm sure you guys could find online, but allegedly there was another person at VidCon who was getting detained by security and he was not cooperative, apparently. So security was being quite harsh on him, and as you can see in the background right here. It's taking several police officers as well as security guards to restrain this person. And allegedly that's what Christian Burns was going off about. But regardless, I mean, you gotta think about it this way. The security at VidCon have a duty to protect a lot of people there. There are literally hundreds and hundreds, perhaps thousands of little kids at VidCon every year. There is in no way that the security guards there can even take a chance that someone who may have a weapon or may be considered dangerous, there's no way they can take that chance and let that person roam freely at a place like VidCon. But anyways, you know, like this situation or not, that's still no reason to go go off on a security guard, let alone anyone the way this guy's doing it. Oh my lord, did he just say he deserves to be crucified? Okay, first Christian said the security guard is like ugly as fudge. He also said that himself is very good looking. He makes a lot of money. Well, here you go, guys. Here is a uh, ya boy Christian Burns, the, uh, you know, the attractive AF Instagram model with 27K followers. Watch out. Yeah, dude. Wow. He, uh, he's definitely the most attractive man I've ever seen. I have to listen to everything he says because he's just so attractive. No. And you know, all those people out there that are just, you know, ugly little punks. Yeah, you ain't got nothing on Christian. Sorry. 
sorry guys, because he's more attractive than you, you gotta do exactly what he says, let alone respect him. No, but seriously, Christian Burns, go fuck yourself, seriously. Like, excuse my language, I, I usually try not to curse on my channel. But you are the epitome of a fuckboy. Like, the worst kind. Out of every fuckboy that I've roasted on my channel, you are by far the worst one I have ever seen. <laughs> Like, you've got celebrity disease to a whole nother level. Maybe a whole other planet. Damn. I, you know, you gotta give the security guards credit for not, for not pummeling him at this point. There's the peasant remark. Well, at least the cameraman is being a little bit honest. You really got to give props to these security guards. Honestly, I don't know how they would put up with someone like Christian, but then again, they probably have to put up with people like him all the time. You know, it just baffles me. I seriously, I don't understand what kind of world we are living in where people can grow up and actually think that these kinds of words are okay and right to say. What are you wearing, you peasant? You're disgusting. Kill yourself. You know, the craziest thing about all of this is, you know, this one person, after all of this is said and done, the security guards go inside, they lock the doors, locking Christian out. Literally, one of the bystanders, one of the kids at VidCon who was recording the entire thing, comes up to Christian, pats him on the back, and he says, Hey, man, I like that thing you did there. You did a good thing there, pal. Here, watch. Just check it out. No, no, no. Don't say that. I don't even know who this is. All right, he's locked out right now. I'm sorry, what? Dude, I like the thing you did today. Very good. Listen here, Mr. Canon 70D with a road mic attachment and a nice gimbal tripod. I don't know if you misunderstood the entire conversation between Christian and the security guards, or if you're actually that stupid to think what he was saying was in any way cool. Well, I like the thing you did today. Now, my take on this, it, you know, the reason why this guy is giving him a pat on the back is because Christian, at this very point in time, is the center of attention. If you guys actually watch the full video, which I will link in my description box, you guys can see that after these security guards lock them out, after this guy gives him a pat on the back, literally everyone who's crowded around Christian is asking him, oh, what's going on? What's going on? Oh, are you famous? Oh, can I take a picture with you too? Christian, of course, ya yeah boy, the Instagram celebrity, soaks up in the glory. All of these kids, they think he's doing a good deed. They think he's the cool man on top. Fact of the matter is, we live in a world where kids, and I mean like younger kids, are growing up being heavily influenced more and more every year. It's come to a point where you have someone who's as douchey and fuckboy as Christian Burns literally becoming the center of attention and people actually patting him on the back and telling him that he did a good thing today. This is exactly why you have to be careful who you look up to as a role model, who you let influence you. And if you're a kid watching this, guys, then I just pray that you don't make stupid decisions like Christian and you don't end up following in his footsteps. Fuck out of my face. Guys, please, please just make the right decisions, okay? Be careful about who you look up to. And please don't ever be a fuckboy, at least not on Christian Burns' level. Also, I think it's kind of funny to note, guys. Apparently, Christian Burns' Instagram account is uh, its uh, disabled right now. Or at least it's unavailable. Maybe it got banned. We don't actually know, but I tried searching for it, and we actually can't find it right now. But the funny thing is, is that he had 27K Instagram followers at the time of this incident. And the security guard who he was insulting, thanks to the power of the internet, this security guard now has even more followers than him. Lol. Over 60 60,000 and counting. That's just the power of the internet, guys, so I have to applaud you on that one. 
But yeah, guys, that's all about do it for this video today. I just wanted to share this with you because there's been a lot of talk about it and there's been a lot of, you know, debate over the internet about what the heck is going on. Let me know your thoughts and opinions down below in the comments. I sincerely hope that, uh, you know, none of you are followers of a uh, Christian Burns, ya yeah boy, Instagram celebrity, watch out guys. But yeah, I hope you guys can take away something from this video. Don't be a fuck boy. And please, please be careful about who you look up to and who you're actually putting into the spotlight. But yeah, with that said, thank you guys so much for watching and until next time, I will see you guys in the next video. Good night.